Hey, a random person on Stroll the Panama channel. I'm Fizzle Chew, aka the Chicken Cake. Today, we're reacting to some r slash choosing beggars. So basically, what r slash choose them beggars is, is usually, you know, people want something that is usually super expensive or just they want it a certain way for free. Let's get into it because tis the season for this joyous topic. <laughs> Okay, first one, Santa Baby, a newer SUV, please. Santa Baby, I must admit that you were a deer last year, but December is here, Santa Baby, so hurry down the chimney tonight. Santa Baby, that 20-year-old SUV is falling apart, engine is slowly leaking. <laughs> I've been especially good this year, and a new SUV is what I'm seeking, Santa Baby. Pretty please, hurry down that chimney tonight. An SUV? How is Santa supposed to bring an SUV down the chimney? I don't think that's possible. Chimney would be gone. I think you're aiming a bit high. That's just my thoughts. I made a Facebook post looking to give Christmas to a kid in need. That's not getting anything, period. And got this today after saying I had already found a kid. This girl messages me once every month asking Asking for money, how would y'all respond? Hey girl, I seen your post about wanting to help someone with Christmas. I'm literally embarrassed to ask, but I need help getting a few little things. His big present was an iPad and nice kids recliner. Now I just want to get a few little things he didn't get to spend last Christmas at home, so I really want to make this one perfect. I get if you can't anymore, just wanted to ask. So the thing is, he's already getting some something big like an iPad, a nice kids recliner. You don't need to ask somebody for help for other things in that department. I think he's already gonna have like a really good Christmas. And the thing is, she was asking for, you know, kids that aren't gonna have anything at Christmas. So I don't think it's fair to ask that in that situation. I just want to say, fuck Santa and Christmas all together. Amen. I'm just kidding. <laughs> What the heck? Uh, Santa operations suck. Don't ever depend on it in time of need. And for all the people that are making fun of a mother who is having a hard time, y'all suck. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't make fun of people when they're having hard times. Because, you know, everybody goes through shit. Don't make it worse. <laughs> Must be nice to have friends, family, and money falling out of your SSA. I don't know what that means. <laughs> I made the mistake and depended on a program I've never used before. That's my fault. I honestly had no idea how the program worked. The website said we try to fulfill every list, so I assumed with my kids asking for things like toys, paint, stuff, and coloring books, they would get fulfilled lesson learned, I guess. That's the thing with those things, y y you can't rely on it, <laughs> you know? You get what you get, and like, it's, it's like a charity thing, right? You know, they're, they're giving things for free, so that kids can, you know, have a better Christmas. And I think saying something, like, rude about that <laughs> is not cool at all. So, just don't? They can only do what they can do. They have a lot of people to think about as well. Like, it's not just you. <laughs> just, that's how I see it. Roblox? But you would be my dev. I'm gonna have to decline. Okay, mind telling me why? Because if I work for you, then I'm gonna be working for either percent exposure or a wage that isn't worth my time you're just doing dev work you said you wanted to develop wait you're saying this was going to be for free all along good game equals fat profits fym i don't know what that means <laughs> i'm sorry fat profit means you're happy a good jjk i'm pretty sure that's jujutsu kaisen game makes me happy <laughs> buddy i'm gonna stop you right here right now I don't work for percentage cut unless the game is from an established studio. I'll take commission up front or half before half after. Or you can go find somebody else to harass. Kai, nobody hires you. It'll take my business elsewhere. Please do. It's like that take you by the word. And you can't take somebody by the word if they haven't done stuff like this. So you gotta have experience with something. Otherwise, nobody will believe you that it will happen, you know? 
and it's good. Don't believe you because people get scammed that way. <laughs> Sorry that this video is a little bit shorter than the rest, but I just wanted to get something out there to say Merry Christmas and I hope your holidays are fantastic. I really enjoy making these videos. I enjoy streaming as well. So, um, I just want to say thank you. Thank you to everyone for this amazing year. And I hope you have a fantastic one. Anyways, safe sailing. Have a great day. It's Chicken King. It's signing off.